Blood cancer can't happen to a 37-year-old that's in amazing shape. Well, the diagnosis said, yes, it can happen. My wife, Keisha, Keisha Rutledge Draft, was diagnosed uh, essentially December 2010. Prior to that, she's just training. She's doing P90X, so she's working. She does, she worked at pharmaceutical sales and just in amazing shape. And so at the beginning of December, she had a little shortness of breath. Her primary care doctor or GP, he says, I, I don't think that there's something that's wrong, but here, let's give you the antibiotics. Uh, how about you just go next door and get a chest x-ray? And he followed the symptoms. Chest x-ray came, came back that she had a mass in her left lung. So I was 37 years old, amazing shape, stage four lung cancer, and it's already spread to her brain. So, picture of health, getting ready for a 10K, doing P90X, and stage four lung cancer. And then a year later, December 27, 2011, she passed away. Why, why is the Like Me campaign so, why is that so important? Well, Like Me is, is a, it's saying that it can happen. It can happen to, to people. It can happen to people like my wife, like, like Keisha. It's people like me. It's people like her that it can happen to because anyone can get it. Unfortunately for me, I, I know that too well. It came into my house. It came in and basically kicked my tail and took my wife. And that's why I know that anyone can get it. I know that people like my wife can get it. Now I think that what I, my hope is, my hope with this campaign, is that people aren't going to have to wait till it happens to them. They're not going to wait until it happens to somebody that's close to them for them to realize that it matters and that it can happen. And so, not just that it can happen, but there's a group here in the UK, the Roy Castle Lung Cancer Foundation, that is leading the way, that is right there with our patients, survivors, and our walking with them, that is fighting for early detection, that is making sure that the, the top treatment options get to the people that can benefit from it. So hopefully they, like me, they understand that anyone can get lung cancer, but not like me actually have to have it happen to them in their home.